In this video, let's find out the AGB In this video, you are going to Why these flies are coming? From where they are coming? In this video, let's find out the 8GB versus the 16GB RAM in Adobe Premiere Pro. If in case you don't know about the Adobe Premiere Pro, Adobe Premiere Pro is a premium editing software, I mean the video editing software and many of the YouTubers and many of the professional workers are also using the Adobe Premiere Pro which includes me. So in this video, let's find out how much RAM is useful for Adobe Premiere Pro. I'm testing this video in only one condition like the exporting of the same video under different RAM categories. First, I export the video with 8GB of RAM and second time I export the video video with 16 GB of RAM. And coming to the RAM specs, myself I'm having the MSI GL65 Leopard laptop. This laptop comes with 8 GB of RAM which is clocked at 266 megahertz and this is a DDR4 RAM. Now I'm going to export the video clip. The main question for this video is whether the 8 GB of RAM or 16 GB of RAM is useful for Adobe Premiere Pro and how much the time difference is there if you export a video. We'll find out in this video. Let's jump into the video. This is the first test with 8GB of RAM. Before that I will show you the installed RAM now. Now I added 8GB RAM into it and let's export the video. I am making the same settings for the 16GB also make sure you noted it. And also the same video too. This is a 1080p video and the length of the video is about 6 minutes 46 seconds. Now the timer is started and let's check how much time does it take. It took exactly 9 minutes 36 seconds to export this video. Now I remove the back panel and add the 16GB RAM into it. Let's see are there any improvements out there. I am assuming some seconds it will save according to my experience. I added the 16GB RAM into it. Now it's time to check. Keeping the settings as usual, I am exporting this video. Let's see how much time it takes to complete it. It took 9 minutes 27 seconds. Comparing both side by side, only 5 seconds it saved. It's not huge but if you are exporting very lengthy projects and editing with a lot of graphics, it makes a sense. Okay, as you can see, there are some minimal differences in time if you observe the 8GB versus 16GB of RAM. But the 16GB is far more better than the 8GB of RAM. If in case you are a new user or a new person to the Adobe Premiere Pro, make sure that you are having minimum 8GB of RAM. And coming to the Adobe software also requires minimum 8GB of RAM to run effectively. If in case you are rendering 4K or 1080p videos, better use the proxy media so that you can edit faster and better and smoother way. In the starting of the video, we found a question that whether the 8GB of RAM or 16GB of RAM is good for this video editing software. So the answer for this question is the 16GB is best than the 8GB of RAM. If in case you are having 8GB of RAM better you upgrade with 16GB or dual channel 8 plus 8GB that is also one of the good option for you. There are many videos are coming like the RAM testing videos in future so make sure that you hit the subscribe button click the bell icon to the side of it and also like this video if you really enjoy it and if you found this video is very informative and interesting for you. As usual, well, my name is Rajeshekar and you are watching Tech Bunny and I will catch you in the next video with a new interesting one. Take care.